In this session, I'm going to talk about the conception of accounting and the need and importance of accounting. In early ages, when commercial activities were based on barter system, there was actually no need for record keeping. Okay, but the industrial revolution which happened in the 19th century along with the rapid rise in population has paved the way for development of commercial activities that was a mass production and credit terms. So recording the business transaction has become an important feature from 19th century. And if you take the recent years where there are lots of changes in technologies and marketing along with stiff competition, accounting system has undergone a remarkable changes. So there is an absolute need and importance for accounting. So in this session, we are going to talk about the need and importance of accounting. So let's first see what are the needs of accounting. See, when a person starts a business, let it be a large business or let it be a small business, his aim is to make profit. Okay, so he receives money from various sources in his business. It may be through a sales or it may be through some interest income if he is making some deposit. Okay, or it may be through bank loans, it may be through the capital and the money received by him have to be spent on various purposes so it may be for purchase of goods so it can be purchase of assets or it can be for payment of salary or it can be for payment of rent so in the business transaction he receives money from various ways and he will spend the money on various items so these activities take place during the normal course of his business he would naturally be interested at the year end to know what is the progress of his business. Business transactions will be numerous so it will not be possible for him to recall from his memory as to how the money had been earned and how it has been spent. At the same time, if he had noted down his incomes and expenditure, then he will readily have the information as to what is his progress so if he had noted down his incomes and expenditures he can readily have the information hence the details of business transactions have to be recorded in a clear and systematic manner to get answers easily and accurately for many questions so like what what can be the questions like what are the information you will be interested if you have recorded all the information if you have recorded all your business transactions i mean you can first ask question as to what happened to your investment you have invested money in the business what happened to the investment number two you may know what is the result of business transactions that is whether you are making profit whether you are suffering loss and you can know what are your earnings right and you can know what are your expenses and you will also know how much money is receivable for you from your customers i mean for whom the goods have been sold on credit and you would know how much is payable to your suppliers from whom you have purchased goods on credit and you can also answer the questions like what are the assets or what are the nature of assets you do own and what are the nature of liabilities what are the nature of liabilities because in the business process you create so many liabilities so not only these questions there are several questions that can be answered with the help of accounting so the need for recording business transactions in a clear and systematic manner is the basis which gives rise to what is known as bookkeeping. So in this session, I have talked about the need and importance of accounting and I've concluded with bookkeeping. So let's see what is bookkeeping in the next session.